I really like the contrast between the fact that we were all working together virtually but talking about uh, and working with a material that is very solid and it was very interesting for me to see people using their own environment uh, around them to express themselves. The private and the public space uh, completely mixed together and uh, that made me think how can we regain control of our private sphere. My idea was to create a, a scenography behind us that can uh, be used as a, an extension of ourselves, but also that can be controlled in a way that you can decide what to show and what to not. I wanted a wood that talk by itself, and I think the cherry do it a lot. And uh, I love it, the warm color of it. I'm working with Benchmark to create a finishing uh, very warm that plays uh, and exalt the, the wood. It's very important nowadays to, to have uh, objects that reminds us uh, that they come from nature, that they change uh, and that they can uh, mutate over time. I wanted the time inside the objects uh, itself. The fact that I was recording the video was a tool that allowed me to develop the product because uh, I was uh, working between the real world and also the, the digitalized world. The camera of my iPhone, of the webcam of, com of my computer was a, a different point of view that allowed me to develop the aesthetic of the cabinets. For me, it was very interesting the contrast between the material that we were using, the wood, super solid, with a tactility and a conversation that was fully digitalized and virtual. I remember the moment I saw for the first time the model made by Benchmark. It was very powerful and emotional because I saw my piece finally, but it was virtual. It was kind of magical. It was a very new experience.